it has become rather clear to me that for whatever reason this game does not want me taking well it, it doesn't want me riding my dinosaur it's alpha shock t-rex just sitting here collecting dust i want to put a saddle on its back i want to ride this thing and just annihilate everything in the world but i can't get a saddle for it and i'm still yet to work out exactly how to get it but i think maybe we need to try and take down a prime alpha t-rex oh we keep going around in circles but we still gotta do it the only thing is we only just managed to take down a savage rex which is far 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 inferior to the prime alpha version I think we're missing one tiny little thing, and that is some potions. If we had our hands on some beautiful little health potions, I think we'd be able to take that sucker down. We gotta, we gotta do it. We gotta get our hands on those things, though. So, uh, I'm gonna work on that. I already got the, uh, I already got it all planned out. Guys, before we get too far into the video, if you do enjoy it, please go ahead, punch that thumbs up while you're at it. Stomp on that subscribe button. Now, let's get crack a lacking. Let's at least look at our options together. You know, it's raining. We may as well do this thing. But there's actually two different healing potions that we can get. There is the healing potion. Requires bee honey, requires dinosaur eggs, requires berries. Then there's this one here, which requires vegetables and jerky and honey. Yeah, and dinosaur eggs as well. So they're pretty much the same sort of thing. I believe they come each from separate mods. Uh, but obviously, one... Well, actually, this one is not too bad, to be honest. Instantly regenerates 50% of your health. Use it in the hot bar. Heals a creature and you. This is actually really good. Actually means I might not need to do what I thought I was going to do. This one, on the other hand, requires... Uh, regenerates 100%. You can use it... For, it's basically the same sort of story. You can use it from your hot bar. It's just far better. And it instantly heals you in its entirety. So I think in the long run, this is what we're going to need regardless. So we should set ourselves up for this. The only thing is, we always need a farm, we need honey, and we need jerky. Well, I've gone and collected everything that we've got to uh, make that happen. We've got a lot of me metal, we've got crystal, and we've got uh, cementing paste. So I'm going to basically go straight into crafting up a ton of greenhouse stuff. We need a big old farm, and I need to get this thing up and running as quick as possible. So, uh, yeah, let's not waste any time, I think. So I legit, I don't know, I don't know how many walls we're going to need, but we're going to need a lot. Let's get a double doorway. Let's get some double doors. And then I guess we'll also gather some ceilings. I don't know how many. We're not gonna. We're not gonna need a hundred walls either. I don't. Will we? I should. All right, maybe we'll just build it out first, and then we'll work out what comes next. We're also obviously gonna need some crop blood. So let's actually. Before I do, are there any special types of? Oh, we could get the tech ones. I think I can actually afford to get these. I just don't have a replicator yet. I also haven't unlocked it. But you know what? We have unlocked crazily enough the transmitter we unlocked that yesterday from killing the savage rex i can't unlock the s plus tech transmitter though dang it that is actually disappointing that would have been fantastic to get our hands on right this second but i guess it just wasn't meant to be which means we are just going to focus on getting ourselves the regular crop plot and maybe some uh, triangular ones as well we got the resources for it we may as well bang 10 of each okay cool so we got the walls check that's way heavier than I kind of expected. I should have known. Uh, wow, that's a lot of walls now that I think about it. Let's grab some foundations. We're actually going to probably need some more of those too. So we'll go and... What are these? Glass triangular foundations. Okay. Didn't know you could craft those, but that makes sense, I guess. All right. Let's get some more stone ones. Let's get some more triangular ones. So what I'm thinking we're going to do to build this thing... Man, this storm just gets keeps getting heavier and heavier. It's nasty. Uh, we're going to build it over here. I feel like this is like the perfect place. I still don't know what I'm doing about this giant hole in the middle of my base. But I'll go and patch this up soon. Um, but yeah, I guess over in this corner. So, foe, eternal Therizinosaur who never got a name. Both of you guys. Over here, please. Let's all get out of the way. Thank you very much. And uh, yeah, this is going to be a little greenhouse area. I should have grabbed those foundations. Now I got to run all the way back over there to get them. Silly Millie. Billy, silly willy, silly jilly, just silly me, really. That's all I'm trying to say. Okay. There we go. Bam, bam, shazoom. Uh, grab some wool. Nope, that's going to be too heavy. All right, get rid of those, get rid of those, get rid of those. Cool. All right, this should be enough to do something with, I think. Okay. So, I think I'm going to... Let's just try and center it. I got to move it, I got to move it. And then, really, I think we're just going to go and build from here. I don't know. I haven't really come in with a plan or anything. So we'll work it out as we go. But um, actually, no, I would like my triangles a little bit further. Let's go and triangulate like so. Are we just going to build lots of triangles? 
that's actually a silly idea now that I think about it. All right, give me one second. I'm going to do some stuff. Well, at least the weather's cleared up, but you know what hasn't? Me misplacing my foundations. The amount of times I had to go and replace them just then. I placed 10 foundations and I had to go and like replace about five of those 10. So it was pretty, pretty nasty. I'm also trying to get rid of this bush. I don't want this bush in the middle of my little greenhouse here. Uh, nor do I want you. You can go as well. Be gone old piece of wood all right so not bad i think it needs to be bigger though so let's go one round what do we do? i don't like that i'm going too symmetrical with this maybe i mix things up just a touch now but then again i think we're kind of beyond that point because we've picked a very symmetrical design let's just do a bit of this and honestly I think I can work with that. All right, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, I didn't grab the crop plots, did I? No, I left them all up here like a bloody banana, didn't I? But hey, at least the sun is now out and about on us. So next up, uh, I guess we'll go and get rid of these. We'll go and get rid of uh, these. We'll go and get rid of all of this as well. Uh, and then we will grab crop plots, crop plots. Not even going to need that many. And a bunch of walls. And of course, our doors. And more walls. And you know what? Maybe I'll just bring all the walls. Eh, maybe I'll leave some of the walls behind because it's kind of heavy. All right. All right. So, actually, crop plots first. Let's do that. Triangulate the center of the thing. Boom. Let's go in. I guess we just want as much coverage as possible. So, we may as well just kind of... Oh, I don't have enough. All right, then. That's cool. Um, I'm going to place some walls up just to see kind of where we're at with things now. Just a nice little around the perimeter. In fact, look at this little walkway we've created. This is actually kind of cool. Um, this is going to take some while to like really populate and stuff though, isn't it? Uh, okay, I need some more crop plots. Man, this is actually... For something that I really didn't plan out, I kind of just... Oh, I need more stone. Are you joking? Uh, anyways, this is actually not looking too bad, to be honest. We've got six plots here. we got... I mean, eight, ten... 10, 11, 12, 30, 14. We've got 14 room for plots. I can then go and place some square boys in the middle here as well, like that. 16 crop plots. Not that bad. That's four a piece. Four of each vegetable. This thing will just blow. Oh, man. Okay, yeah, I think we're uh I think we're off for a pretty good start here. Once this thing is all fertilized and ready to go, uh, we're gonna be laughing. We're gonna have so many done crop plots, crops, plots, crops and plots. We're just gonna have a lot of stuff going on. It's gonna be sweet. Alright. Uh, Double door in the middle. I'm, I've, I've really impressed myself with this tiny little speed build here. The only thing is I've overdone it with greenhouse stuff. And we also need a ceiling. So, well, we got, we got to do something with them. We may as well just go one level higher because, well, they're going to go to waste anyways. <laughs> There's no reason not to. There we go. We could even go one higher again, but I think that would just be a little bit too extra. But overall, I, I like what we're doing. It's a shame we've got to run all the way up here every single time. Also, it probably should have worked out exactly what I need as far as um, ceilings go. Because now I've got no idea. One, uh, let's go six, seven, eight, nine. I feel like we need nine of these. That's my random little guess. We'll see how that goes. And then we need a bunch of triangles. Six, 12, maybe 16. So nine squares, 16 of these. That's my guess. I guess we'll uh, we'll see what happens, hey? 13, 14, 15, and 16. All right, let's see. Did I get it right? Probably should have just rolled the dice and got a couple extras just in case. But, you know, I'm not the smartest. And I don't claim to be either. So... Let's go and start, bam, and let's start, bam, and let's start, bam, and right there. Okay, cool, 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 cool. How about the triangles? Are they going to fit in where I want them to fit? Let's actually try and do this without misplacing any. I nearly just placed one on like one level too far, far down, but all good. All good. Ah, I knew it. It was only a matter of time. I'm short. My, my calculations were like ridiculously incorrect, I think. Oh, let's actually have a look. Nope, not you. These ones here though, yes. Okay, wham. Um, bam, bam. How far short am I? I'm very short. We're missing one, two, three, four triangles. Other than that, we actually overdid it with the squares, I think. Just a tiny little bit. I think. I can't even tell where I've got. Yeah, okay, we're missing a few. 
All right, let me go and sort that out then. Wow, we only actually had one extra ceiling. But anyways, four triangles short is what it is. We're also going to need some pipes, aren't we? Now, I'm hoping that I can just get by with like one of these and then a tap. Oh, we're going to need a few taps, actually. Actually, oh man, I just need stone. How do I not have any stone? Do I have at least have some stones in the base? We do. Nope, that's a Quetzal. That is 100%. Oh, we got stones in the base. Never mind. I clearly don't know what I'm talking about. That'll probably get us by, to be honest. Leave it at that. In fact, I can just craft these things on myself, can't I? Pipes. Let's get intake. Intake. Let's get another intake. Let's get some taps. Because we're going to need a bunch of them too. Um, in fact, let's get one more intake just for good luck. And then we'll see if we can make do with just that. I'm actually really liking our little greenhouse here. For something I slapped together so quickly. Not bad at all. There we go. Okay, cool. So, uh, we are, I'm hoping, no, this is what I was worried about. Actually, you know what? With the amount that the, it rains in this world, I could technically get myself a metal, I'm thinking like a water reservoir. What? I can't craft that down here? Where do I craft a water reservoir? It rains so much that we could pretty much just, uh, water this stuff from the rain. But then again... Do I just not know how to craft this stuff? We can get a lot of these things. My god. Oh, it's called a water tank. That's why. All right. One, two, three, and four. Meh. Or five, I guess. That's way more than I needed. Fair enough, though. Uh, we got some, re some water tanks now. That can feed them. And then other than that, we're also going to need some compost bins. So probably a lot of them just so we can, like, stockpile as much of this stuff as possible. And on top of that, just to go and, you know, sort it all out once and for all, I think think i'm actually gonna get this i've never had one of these before but we may as well an item collector and an item aggregator now i don't know how the aggregator works but i think it's just one of those things we should get uh supposedly actually this is a place right here and we can work this out together so the item collector distributes stuff uh it needs propellants lucky for us i have lots of propellants bam get it in there activate cool this guy here is going to collect all of our poop and I would like him to distribute it, but he probably won't. I don't think he does. Uh, stop distributing poop. I mean, no, it does. It says he will. Well, I guess find out if he does. Then you've got this. And I've never had one of these before, but this here is an aggregator. I also can't power this because it needs a tech generator. So that's a little bit sucky. But it collects and distributes many items and oh, from and too many things. So I don't really know how it works, but I guess it picks everything up. <gasps> Crops as well. Oh, okay. That's actually really handy. Um, I just need a generator, but I haven't unlocked it yet. So I'm going to work out what we need to kill to unlock that then. Oh, well, is what it is. So water tanks. I guess they can sit on the roof. Yeah, why not? Makes sense, I guess. Or in the ground. I don't know. Are they sitting on the roof or like in the roof? Eh, it works. Something like that. That one there needs to be moved, but it's all good. And then I'm going to have to run some taps down from them somehow. Um, okay, these taps want to kind of lock all over the place for some reason. Okay, that's kind of weird. Why is everything locking into weird places like this? I'm not used to this. This is kind of weird. All right, we're going to need some more pipes, I think. Uh, let's get some vertical ones. Five of those, maybe. And then on top of that, I'm also going to grab some flexies. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so vertical pipe. Here's what I'm thinking. Bam. Um, I need more crop plots. I forgot about that. One here. Bam. And then, yeah, I guess one over here as well. Oh, or did I just place two of them down? I have no idea what I just did. Uh, but anyways, now what I'm hoping to do is go... Uh, is this what I want to do? I have no idea what I'm doing right now. <laughs> this is not what I had planned at all, but I, I, I guess... Um, we're going to throw a, a tap has to sit there. A tap has to sit there and a tap has to sit. I don't even know where that placed. I placed one down somewhere and it wasn't meant to be. Who knows? We'll work it out in a sec. Wait, what? Why are you here? Okay. Things are just placed in everywhere. This is bizarre. Maybe we just had too much luck before this or something. I don't know. Uh, but then kind of i just want to extend that to that can we can we just can we do that it's a weird one i know i'm actually gonna see if this works something like that <laughs> this is so weird um i think it's connected there's just no water in it 
for the first time ever, I'm actually like, I gotta wait for rain to fall now. Uh, do I need this then? I guess I did. Whoops. Uh, dang it. Okay, that sucks. Where did I place those extra little taps then? Because now I don't know where they're at. All right, let me go and take this one. Can I place that here? No. Okay, we. I guess we are maybe going to need the vertical. Dang it. I ruined everything. All right. Oh, yeah, lock on. Lock on right there. And I guess we'll just have the tap here in the middle. All right, let's hope that that works. We're not going to know until the water comes, but we'll, uh, we'll find out shortly, I suppose. This is weird but it, it's working i think we're gonna need some more taps though i think tap me up let's go and more verticals this i don't i don't, I don't know i really like literally legit don't know i'm breaking like every rule i have when it comes to like design this just isn't my normal base plans i guess <laughs> but it's working i think uh I'm, I'm a little bit skeptical, not gonna lie. All right, I want these two to connect. Something like that. Yeah, I guess, maybe. <laughs> we'll see. And then I'm actually missing one little reservoir up there. Do I have my, I do, oh, I got this. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, let me go and fix this base up, or this, this roof up, because this roof is just all over the shop right now. I'm gonna pick you up, and then I'm gonna place you like that. All right, and then I'm actually gonna pick this one up, and we're gonna place it over here. That's wrong. It's wrong, you're not meant to place like that. The suckiest part of this all is we're gonna have to wait for rain to know if this is actually gonna work or not. All right, do I have to place this from down here then? Cause it's not really sitting where I want it to be sitting. It's like in this awkward, ah, yep, that's the one. Okay, so vertical, check, okay. Uh, I don't even need, nope, we're good, okay. Tap check and last but not least we need to line these two up please how did i do this before aha uh -huh. like that so i want a straight line and then as high as possible bam all right there we go and the other two reservoirs who knows what they're for they're just a complete and utter waste in fact you know what i could do we could double down on the liquids something like this this is so so bad <laughs> no, that's not what I told you. Ah, it doesn't matter. You know what? I feel like it makes the place look kind of funny when there's pipes running everywhere. So let's get some pipes running everywhere, I guess. Uh, You know what? Yep, that'll do. And I've run out of pipes. All right, cool. Well, now we just need to wait for water. And, oh, fertilizer, of course, too. Where did I put my compost bins? Did I craft compost bins? That was one of the things I did say we needed. So let's go. And we'll drop some compost bins down, too. And I don't really have anywhere good to place these. So along the back of the base, I guess. There we go, something like that. I don't know, bit of a mess, but it works. Cool. Uh, now we just need to wait for my poop to be distributed. So hopefully um, that doesn't take too long. All right, how's my dude over here going, eh? He's supposedly full of, full of poop. He's got a poop buffer. Are you picking up the poop or what, mate? Look at all these dinosaurs. Maybe they're just not pooping yet. Are you guys not pooping? I see poop, buddy. I ain't paying you to just sit around and not collect poop. What do you think this is? You just you just decided not to pick up poop? Yes, pick up the poop. It's, it's your one and only job, mate. What are you doing? Uh, Stop distributing. Distribute? Yeah, okay. Yep, distribute. Collection options. Yep, we've already sort of sussed that out, haven't we? What's the problem? The range? No, the range is freaking enormous. The range is fine. Where's the poop? Hmm. Unless... <gasps> I know where the poop is. The poop's up here. I forgot we've got a, we've got a fertilizer up. Think, think of a bobby up here. It's been making me fertilizer for a while. I forgot about you. Okay. Well, uh, you know what? You can just make me poop as well. We got, we got extra thatch. You make me some poop too. Thank you very much. And I guess this one as well. Whatever. We've got it all sorted though. We're going to be... We're having so much fertilizer soon. It's going to be amazing. Fantastic. All right. Well, now that that's sorted, I guess we can move on to other things. And other things, well, we need the honey. The honey's going to be a hard part now too. So I think there actually is a way around this. I think we can go and get us a domesticated beehive. Unfortunately, to get this, well, like I said, we need honey. We need red flowers. I've got red flowers. I don't, I don't think I've got honey, actually. I, I might have honey. Have we collected honey at any point from like resource drops? I would say not, but hey, let's find out. 
honey no we don't have any honey that's 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 a shame um definitely not right we need 50 giants all right well fine i guess on that note it's time for me and the denominator over here to head out and look for some honey and i have no idea where to find some but i think we're gonna have to go to the redwood forest biome that's probably the that makes the most sense at least it's been a while since we've been out there let's go all right so we can actually do something here to help us out i'm going to activate outline aggression and what this is going to do is it's going to outline every single dinosaur including this weird alpha gigantopithecus that's just floating around you feeling all right there buddy um look i don't i don't know what you're doing but i'll help you out there you look a little bit uncomfortable it's going to outline everything including beehives i hope i think at least it should so it's also going to outline thylacolios which doesn't really mean much to us right this second because i doubt they can dismount me from manticore but i'm hoping it'll show me some beehives soon ish maybe generally i'm pretty sure they show up red maybe i just can't remember it's been a while since i've had to go looking for bee honey i wonder if there's a bee honey cave on this map maybe prime alpha rg over there cool gonna stay away from that because my man's core nearly died to one of those also i've seen comments people telling me that i need to put a saddle on this thing look i get it but i don't think there's a man's core saddle for this guy have a look at this there's that different mods separate mod can't equip that one in here also can't afford it it's ridiculously expensive so yeah i don't have a man's core saddle to put on this guy just as a you know a heads up okay that's why i haven't done that i'm just i'm not ignoring the fact <gasps> my dude needs a saddle that's that's why we haven't done it we've found ourselves a beehive though so that is fantastic news oh gosh uh that wasn't part of the plan also i guess i don't take fall damage so that's nice might be part of our new set of ride gear that's fantastic forgot this man's core is useless at you know sitting on its back so can i steal some honey from you please we now how do these honeybees work because I, I never i never fight bees normally but i'm pretty sure yeah you can kill these and i'm pretty sure then you can like tame their queen i've just never done it before so i, I don't really know how it works giant bee you're dead too if i keep killing them do i eventually get their their boss the queen i think she's she's called i think that's her name this is such a disaster come on come on little bee honeys all right there we go is that it any nope okay cool all right good to know uh no no giant bees then unless i maybe unless i nope okay all right that's fine uh we got five bee honey out of that only five bee honey we're gonna need a little bit more than that unfortunately um buddy i have really good armor on i don't even think you can damage me through this armor that's how good it is so nice try i i respect it but at the same time kind of don't um this is interesting i don't really know what's going on here but this this warden is taking quite an amount of damage from something i i don't i a terror i mean i feel you old buddy but it's a terror bird dude he's taking you down 10 million health i don't know how i'm just gonna let these guys keep doing what they're doing if there's a chance that this thing dies I mean, I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take a free ward and kill any day of the week. Uh, I did a little bit of research on how these bee honeybees work. Supposedly, by destroying the hive, there is a chance. Well, the, the queen's meant to come out and say hello. There she is. And she can then make us our own little honey things in our base. The thing is, you need to tame them. And I don't think I have what it takes to tame it. Um, what do I need? It says I need. Hold on. Where is it? Where are you? prime meat i mean i got prime meat i don't have mutton but i can i could i could give you some prime meat let's just hope this carne just doesn't bother us hey all right let's see what i can do here i've destroyed her hive but she's pretty chill about it for some reason can i just passive it says you're a passive tame take my oh gosh all right she's just laying a lot of bees all right you little pests can you bugger off please i was trying to feed your queen i actually have no idea how this works i've never done this before no please i've got ah oh, maybe i meant to creep up on her you know it would have been handy for this our gilly armor that we just got rid of yesterday probably would have been perfect yeah she ain't trust me one bit does she hmm 
Okay. Yeah. It turns out, yeah, you are meant to use either bug repellent or ghillie armor, which I really wish I had done this yesterday, but we didn't. So we're going to try and do it today instead, like this. Don't ask me. Nah, nah. Can't even get close to her before she goes and lays her little babies. It's okay. I promise. I promise I'm not going to hurt you. Just, I've got meat for you. Oh, it worked. <laughs> okay, then. Obtain beehive. Oh, okay, just like that. Well, there we go. We've got a beehive. Wow, okay, I didn't actually expect that to work, but it did. Fantastic. Well, now I guess I can just passively generate honey uh, at the base, and the rest is history. I have no idea still how this works, but that just happened. So, awesome. Uh, also, let's go and get rid of this outline aggression because it's kind of uh, invasive on my face. And let's also see how these little metal tanks are going. Are they full of water yet? Because it did rain. I just wasn't here to see it. Refresh connections. I don't know what that means, but okay. There's no water in them. What do you mean? All right, I'm going to have to have a little suss of this again. All right, beehive, you can chill out here. I have no idea how this thing works. Provide rare flower. Wait, what? I'm taking damage? Okay, have some, have some rare flowers. And I guess we'll check in with this thing soon. Man, bees, come on. I own you. What are you going to wait? Why you do this? And gonna do it again too, aren't they? All right. I think for some reason. <gasps> hey, it's got water in it. You don't. You don't. You don't. You don't. But you do. It says not. Oh, but you're not connected to nothing. Are you serious? The one. Oh. The one that's not connected to anything. Because these are. Yeah, look. These have all got water in them now. Yes. Okay, nice. Nice. They just need seeds. I forgot about seeds. Oh, you absolute banana. Matt, why? Why am I always like halfway on everything, hey? I'm always halfway there, but never like the full. I'm a, I'm a few eggs short of a dozen. You know what I mean? Anyways, I gotta go get seeds for these things. I'm gonna seed them. I'm gonna fertilize them, especially once my dinos have done enough poop. And then I can actually, yep, they're getting there. We're getting poop. We're gonna have to fertilize them. Hopefully tomorrow we'll have a ton of crops and uh, we'll be able to get some health potions and then eventually able to go ahead and fight ourselves some stronger creatures i yeah <laughs> what a weird day man but uh i'll catch you tomorrow bye